Contact. Hello everybody, welcome to America. Um, today I just want to do a quick one um, and briefly go over how semi-truck, air brakes, S-cam brakes in specific work. Um, so I got them half taken apart. I'm putting brakes on my Mac right now, um, but I figured this would be a good time to show you because sometimes people wonder. Um, so there's a drum that goes on here which is a cast iron piece of apparatus. Uh, so what happens is when this is charged with air, air comes into this brake chamber, turns this air energy into mechanical en energy and pushes on this, which is connected to the slack adjuster, which connects to the S-cam shaft. And what that does is it turns this S-cam. They call it that because it kind of looks like the letter S. So it turns it this way. And as it turns, it, grab a bar. As it rotates, this spins and it spreads these apart. They press against the drum that sits over top of this creates friction and hopefully you stop. And in addition to that, as these shoes and the drums wear, there's what's called a slack adjuster. So right now it's adjusted all the way in, but if you were to turn it this way, we will see as it goes, and that's to take up the slack as these wear, because there's only so much range of motion on this chamber, and it can go all the way like so. And that's basically the same thing as what happens when you turn or push the pedal down to engage the brakes. So there it is, S-cam air brakes, big truck air brakes, whatever you want to call them. Um, a lot of the trucks are going to disc brakes now. I have no idea how those work because I've never worked on them. Um, so don't quote me on that, but that's uh, S-cam style drum air brakes on, uh, on a semi-truck, big truck, commercial vehicle, whatever you want to call it. So until next time, stay American.